Oh, that's a good one. Today, we're going to learn how to play Upwards, the high-scoring, high-stacking board game. Soup. Oh, yeah. Okay, uh, mine. <laughs> Inside the box, you're going to find a plastic game board, four rubber feet, 100 plastic letter tiles, four plastic tile racks, one label sheet, and the complete Upwards board game rules and instructions. Let's set up the game. First, create a draw pile by turning all the tiles face down and mixing them up. Now, pass out a plastic tile rack to each player. Be sure to have a pencil and paper ready to keep score, and a dictionary ready to challenge any words that players think are misspelled or illegal. Real words only! Each player draws one tile from the pile. Whoever draws the letter earliest in the alphabet goes first. Be sure to return the tiles face down to the pile and mix them with the others. The game goes counterclockwise. Before you can begin, each player draws seven tiles and stands them on the rack. Be sure to hide your letters from the other players. Now, let's go over the rules. Score two points per tile for any word formed in which the letters are only one tile high. For example, the word wood contains four letters and each letter is only one tile high. After multiplying four tiles by two, we figure out that this word is worth eight points. Score one point per tile for any word in which one or more letters are stacked on top of each other. Count each letter in the stacked word and every tile that's stacked up under the word. For example, if you turn the word wood into good, you'll get five points. One per tile used and one extra for stacking. Score two bonus points if you use the QU tile in a word whose letters are all only one tile high. Score an extra 20 points if you use all seven of your tiles in a single turn. If a stack of letters is used in more than one word, both words are scored. Before you begin the game, choose a scorekeeper to record everyone's score after each turn. After each turn, be sure to draw letters to replace the ones you've played. The game starts by forming the first word. The first player's word must be at least two letters long and cover up one of the special game squares in the center of the board. The next player places one or more letter tiles on the game board during their turn. They have the option to form a new word by adding tiles that connect to a word already on the board, or that can change a word already on the board into a different one by stacking letters on top of it. All your letters must go across or down and need to connect to a word already on the board. Once you place your word, add up your points and announce them to the scorekeeper. Another rule to be mindful of is you can't put an S at the end of a word and make it plural. If you can't make a word with your letters, you can always exchange your tiles for new ones. If you like your letters but can't seem to find anything that works on the board, you can always pass your turn. The game ends when all the letters have been played or when none of the players can create any more words with their tiles. Each player adds up their final score and subtracts five for each tile they have left unplayed. Whoever has the highest score wins the game. Upwards is a challenging and fun board game that the whole family will want to play again and again.